Search for clues. That is a hand! He picks up the shoe first. Uh, uh, you're a cougar! Oh, John, hurry! Oh, John, hurry! Oh, God, please, John, hurry! Oh, jeez. Oh, God, there's a cougar around these hills. I hear it. It's, like, right over here. Nope. Cougar claw plus one. That is a hand. So that's it. Fuck! <laughs> God dang it! Ah! No, 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 no! Son of God dang it! No! You're never expecting the second cougar. As a reminder to everybody, everybody say hi to YouTube! going up on YouTube eventually. So, as a result, the alerts are turned off. If I'm not as interactive with chat as like you're used to, I'm so sorry. I really, really, really am, but I need to make it easy either for myself or for Taylor to edit. And unfortunately that means less ramble, ramble, ramble with chat than more basic play the game. Ugh, where are we last? Oh, hold on, we can get into the game for this. Um, once again, hi YouTube, hi Taylor, or hi Future Basic. Purple Rockstar logo is pretty cute. All right, Red Dead Redemption, the John Marston story. Where we last left off? Um, ugh, Bonnie. That's all I really gotta say. John and Bonnie are flirting up a storm. And John told Bonnie the truth. He's like, listen, I used to be an outlaw. And then I took a Nagagale to the knee. And now I'm a rancher, but now I'm being blackmailed to go track down my old brothers in arms. And that's where we're at. Um, Wes Dickens. He is a wily, a wily old guy, isn't he? Wes Dickens uh, is, is selling some snake oil. We help him do it. People are really upset because there's outlaws in the area, Bill Williamson's gang. They're like, oh my god, Sheriff Marshall, man. Can't believe you wouldn't take care of them. He's like, I don't know what you want me to do. All right, let's get into uh, the game. Red Dead Redemption. Alrighty. The lady is walking, taking the stairs two at a time. Hello, ma'am. Howdy, ma'am. Do you guys hear that? She's a very good lover, sir. Um, unfortunately, that is not the best pickup line I have ever heard, so I am not interested. This dude is always getting it, though. I gotta say... He is so Sorry, much more exciting than any of the piano players in Red Dead 2. Howdy. Do you take requests, sir? I don't have a lot of money, but like, I will give you a dollar if you can uh, play Old Town Road. Cocksucker drink. All right. Let's look at our... Look at our map. Okay, John Marston is here. Oh, there's a, oh, American Appetites. Let's do that. Let us go ahead and do American Appetites. Ah, let's go see what's going on there. I think those are like the cannibals in the woods or something, right? Ride horse. This is um, our new Dakuna. Let's go. Marshall. Dude, is he challenging me? Oh, absolutely. Farewell. You want some of this? Do you? Would you like some of this? What did you What did you need, sir? How about I'm Easy part famous. All you gotta do is Howdy. agree to a duel. Yes. Yes. Sure. Yes. It's your funeral. Yes. Yes. All right. Yes. Here we go, here we go, here we I don't know if I remember, I think that I remember, but this is... All right, Clifton led better. I'm supposed to just shoot it out of his hand though, right? I'm supposed to just shoot it out of his hand and not like actually shoot him. 
So good with a, his quick draw. Word of your deeds is slowly spreading through the countryside like tuberculosis. Sissy townsfolk in a good way. Oh. Oh, there it goes. Okay. Oh, boy. Off you run, you yellow-bellied coward. Indeed, though. Where did my... Did, did I scare them away? This is where, uh... Bro! Freaking... I guess that they got scared. All right, I guess John's gonna go to the movies while we wait for people to get not scared. This movie theater sure looks a lot like a church to me. Two dollars? Like 50 blocks. cents in Red Dead 2. I guess, you know, times have changed. Inflation hits us all. Bean eater. <laughs> Zoom in. The dangers of doctors! <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> what torments or ails you, sir? His back, he's got lumbago! Blindy pain of a sinister expression. He's uncle. I got lumbago. Doc West. Morphine and swamp gas. Gracious creator of hellfire. Spiritual revelations. My entrails are... Oh, I missed the last thing. Uh-oh. He just died. We paid two dollars for this. We paid two dollars for this? You have adopted an affliction, sir? He's hungry. Oh, no, he's not hungry. Oh, tapeworms and cholera. <laughs> I was like, he's got a stomach ache until he started like humping his hat. She's like, absolutely not. I just saw, I just saw what came out of your booty hole. Uh, uh, no, 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 no. Don't have a singular word. Nothing. I am speechless. Oh boy. Tempestuous toothaches. Are you giving morphine to the child? Cough cream and pain reliever? A lot enough, literally. Oh, this kid's about to become addicted to drugs. <laughs> Just uh, Molly from What Remains of Edith Finch. Hey! Casual little uh, brutal murder. The dangers of doctors. On break. Hey. Mexican herbs of joy! <laughs> Invisible tonic, one use. Uh, 
He's just invisible now. Falling into hell. This is just D and D. <laughs> Medical science cannot save you. It will kill you and leave you dead. Anti saloon league and temperance union. As somebody behind me is hacking up along, I'm about to catch TV. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh goodness. 10 out of 10. <laughs> Jeff, hey, what's going on? Narco, also hello. I hope you got your cookie. 10 out of 10. You guys want to watch it again? Two more dollars. John Marston, did you... God, there's another person that just needs my help. Oh, this shit, dog! Alright. Alright. My horse just got rustled. Do not... Yeah, do not take medical advice from, uh... From this video game. Uh, go Let's see go. doctors. <laughs> please. If you are ill, please see a doctor. Oh my god. Oh. Oh my god. You failed to stop the crime and I broke the law? No! $500 bounty. How did this happen? I was trying to stop the horse rustler. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. No, 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 no. I was not the one who broke the law. It was, oh my goodness. I'm not, I'm not doing that. All right. American appetites. Mister, she's gone. Who is? My wife, she's gone. She went out picking mushrooms in the hills. They're hanging rock and they Can't got be doing her. That. The stories are true. <laughs> What'd the police do about it? <laughs> oh, about as much as you'd expect. <laughs> Made me fill out a form. <laughs> I don't know why that was funny. Strong, but, <laughs> but she's a good girl. I'll see what I can do. <laughs> it wasn't funny. That's not funny. <laughs> Hello, sir. You can take my wife. How about that? She is strong, uh, but not a good girl. And I will take Bonnie. How about that? Come on. How about that? Seems like a good trade to me. All right. Zoom. American appetites. There are cannibals. You're going to tell me that this is not clearly cannibals in these hills? Come on. It is. She literally went and just picked mushrooms, made it easy for them to make a nice beef stroganoff for dinner. They caught her and they were like, oh, thanks, now we don't have to pick mushrooms. Yeah. Zoom, zoom. Beep, 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 boop. Boop, boop, beep, 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 boop. Yeah, win, win. We'll give him Abigail. And we will, uh, we'll go propose to Bonnie. Twentieth century? It is. It is twentieth century. It's like 1911 right now. Isn't Bonnie married? Nope. We had a whole conversation with Bonnie last stream about she how she never married. John was like, I'm sure it's not because of lack of suitors, and she was like, Oh well, there's a couple. But I had to be the man of the family. I had to run this ranch. My brother ran off or something like that. Maybe he died. I can't remember. Something happened to her brother. She's like, yeah, you know, it is what it is. <laughs> All right, John needs to take a left. Let's go. Get this up 
here? Maybe, perhaps? Hennigan's stunt? Oh. I hear, uh, hear some firing? Is it over in this direction? Ah, oh god, please be careful, my pony! Remember when we had Horsea? And then we lost Horsea? Uh-oh. We're about to find another, like, body part, aren't we? I would guess we're about to find a mushroom basket and some body parts. Oh, blood! A hat! Search for clues. That is a hand! He picks up the shoe first! Oh, uh, you're a cougar! Oh, John, hurry! Oh, John, hurry! Oh, God, please, John, hurry! Oh, jeez. Oh, God, there's a cougar around these hills. I hear it. It's, like, right over here. Nope. <laughs> jeez. All right. Close one. Close one. Skin animal? I mean, I guess. You stink. <laughs> Just that insult to injury. You stink. I cannot imagine that John Marston smells too good. Cougar claw plus one. That is a hand. So that's it. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> God dang it! Ah! Son of a bitch! Son of a bitch! Son of a bitch! Expecting the second cougar. Alright. Inside, I guess we're going. You okay, lady? <laughs> My husband's missing. <laughs> These bastards won't do anything. But he's a good man. He don't drink nor lay with whores. And he's been he's been missing for three days. He's a good man. Oh, yes. You went Doesn't up drink the hills? or sleep around. Therefore, you know, he must be good. Yes. If I find him, I'll bring him back to you. But people seem to go missing up there. Oh, oh my God. If he's gone, then what'll I do? We ain't got much money. <sighs> Only way again. As I said, I'll do what I can. I'm in the family way. <laughs> I'm in the family way again. That's how you say pregnant in 1911. Hey, Mary, welcome in. This is Red Dead 1 story is what we are currently doing. This is the story mode. All righty. You know how we have all of our markers? Whoa! Hey, help me. I've been attacked. Hello, sir. Uh, oh, mister, I think I met your wife. Mister, some city fella just attacked me and broke my leg. What? He broke my leg. Some city fella. Guy got kind of creepy on me. And then he got violent. Excuse me. When? Just now. Uh, he ran off that way. Can't have gone too far. If I find him, I'll bring him back this way. This Thank guy's you, like, I don't really care if you bring him back to me. Maybe we just take him to jail. Maybe we just kill him. Hog tie the attacker and bring him. Oh, he literally is just right there. He's just <laughs> circling. <laughs> You're all crazy. Sir, are you. Is your wife pregnant? Something What's tells me that. You? Something tells me he's not the cannibal. Something tells me the other guy is the cannibal. This guy looks like the kind Please. of guy who doesn't drink. I'll do anything. There's another cougar! I hear it! Son of a gun! Uh, no! This, Freaking god dang it! Ah! You wanna know what a nightmare is? The cougars in this game! Zoom! All 
right, it's this guy again. I've been attacked. Blah, 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 blah. You gotta help me, mister. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, 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 mister, mister. Some city fella just attacked me. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, here we go. Oh, God, this sucks. This sucks because here's the deal. I'm not gonna have time to get my... This... I'm not gonna have time to get the lasso out. Please! Or the gun once the, the cougar is gonna... Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Run, John, run, 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 run. Run, 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 He's a runner. He's a track star. Okay. Tie him up. Booty. Now. I don't hear the... I don't... I don't hear the cougar yet, but... Like, I know that it's around. Sir, did you want to defend yourself in any way, shape, or form? Did you have anything to say? I bet you that this is the, the husband of the lady who's pregnant. And that that guy up there. That guy up there, no offense to him. No, no, no offense meant. But he looks like a guy Don't who... Don't take me back to that man. He looks like a guy who be drinking a little bit. And she said, my husband doesn't drink or sleep with... Ladies of the night. That guy over there looks like he's enjoyed... A beverage or two. Maybe a lady of the night or two. I'm guessing that this is the husband and he's defending himself against uh that guy who is the cannibal. That's my that's my guess. Alright, so let's go, John. <laughs> the climbing. <laughs> Alright, sir, did you have anything you wanted to say before I take you back? Uh. We're running. Oh, I ran into that cactus. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. <sighs> huffing and puffing. He's a huffing and he's a puffing. That's him! All right. What you got to say, though, sir? Oh, my good oh. lord. Please get that man away from me! Uh, uh. Hey, fella! Uh, <laughs> you broke this oh, no. poor fool's oh, leg, mister! Uh, this maniac tried to eat me! Yep! We've got cannibals in these here hills! Please help me! What? Please. Fella's gotta eat now. Fella's got to eat. Uh. <laughs> what? John, <laughs> shoot him! Please! Please! John, what are you doing? John, what are you doing? No! No, John! No! God, Dad, no! <laughs> That you just casually started walking away? What? <laughs> He's like, well, this is really none of my business. This is uh, really none of my business. <laughs> John! Cut free. Don't annoy me unduly. All right. See you later, sir. We got cannibals in these here woods. That was absolutely ridiculous. John. John. I thought you scared all of the cannibals away from the United States. I guess not. The guy was li also, can we just, that man was literally about to just start chomping in. Zero shame. Did not even deny it for a second. Not even a little bit of denial. He was just like, well, <laughs> time to eat. With what? He was going to eat him there alive? Didn't even want to cook him. He was just going to just dive on in. He was just going to dive on in with his chompers. I didn't see his knife or a fork in his hands. Absolutely outrageous. Just gonna go for a jump. <laughs> Likes him raw and wriggling. Mm. I'm gonna be sick. Give it to us raw and wriggling. The absolutely most vile line in the entire Lord of the Rings universe. Dahmer would be disappointed. Cedar, hello. Oh my god. Oh boy. <laughs> he 
should have made him pull out a fork and knife. <laughs> Can you imagine? Oh my god, that would have been so good. The guy just like ties a bib as if he's about to uh, dive into some barbecue ribs or something. He just ties a bib around his neck, pulls out a fork and a knife, and goes to town. <laughs> oh, oh, Red Dead. Oh, Red Dead. All right, what do we got? John? Maybe we go back to... Um... All right, we got Seth here. We have not met Seth. You guys seem to like the idea of Seth. Um, There is a stranger here over by Ridgewood Farm. And then we've also got... We've always got Bounty. Ugh. My Bonnie lies over the ocean. My Bonnie lies over the sea. You guys seem to be excited about Seth, though. Last time we were here, you guys all, everybody was just like, Yeah! Seth! We love Seth! So let's go, let's figure out who Seth is. Alrighty. Oh. Who's this? This is not Seth. This is another stranger. Where can he be? Hello, man. Talk to the woman. Everything all right, madam? It's Miss. Oh. Oh, let me look at you. My gentleman caller. You remind me of my Peter. Have you seen him? I don't think so. A gentleman Where caller? Is that man? We'll be late for the ceremony. He must still be at the saloon in Armadillo talking to the musicians. He's such a fine man. Must be making things right for me, as usual. Well, I gotta get going, ma'am. I'm sure your Peter will be just fine. Wait, I beg you. <laughs> Would you possibly go fetch him for me? John said, "Don't this touch was me." Meant to be Excuse. A day. Please, sir. Something must have happened. I can't bear it. So you want me to go find your <gasps> Peter so you can have a perfect day? Yes. <laughs> please, sir. He says it with such disdain in his voice. Oh. So you want me to go find your Peter so that you can have a perfect day? I'll see what I can do. Man, this church is no longer. I will, I will go find your Peter later. Seth. Coots Chapel. Sir, your horse is not looking so great. Can I give this horse a snack? You need, you need a little, you need an apple. You need a little apple, buddy. Your skin and bones! Please, can I give this horse an apple? Don't, not you. How do I? Or maybe, well, hold on, hold on. Is it, it's consumables kit provisions can they can they use these horse pills hello they only use horse pills while mounted oh poor horse my horse does not look he's doing very great his name is spooky is it really Open container? <laughs> Absolutely, we're gonna loot. Anything good? Medicine. Nice. Chest. $13 deadly assassin menu entry added. Oh, did I get a piece of uh, clothing? Yo, let's go. Yo, let's go. All right, John, let's see. Where's the entrance to this? Can I? Oh, I guess I just walk through here. 
I just assumed that I couldn't, but I, I you know what? Excuse me, sir. What you doing? Excuse me, are you Seth? Who are you? I'm a friend of Mr. West Dickens. You? My name is Marston. John Marston. Goodbye, John Marston. <laughs> it's been a great pleasure. I need your help, Seth. We need your help. Me and Mr. West Dickens. Let me be frank for one second, partner. I hate people. It was people who got me in this mess in the first place. He is disgusting looking. <laughs> Look at me. Look, scrambling around. Look for maps, half insane. I ain't washed in six months. My hair falling out. My mind's going. What happened? <laughs> what happened? My partner. He stole half my map. I never would have done that to him. Never. Look at me. This is the who old did man. This to you? My partner, my boy, my man, Moses Ford. This is y'all's man? I don't have the facility to tell you what I would have done for that man. And what I would do to him now. Why? Because he stole half my goddamn map. And what map's that then? The map, partner. The map that tells me where it is. Where what is, friend? I ain't telling you that. I ain't. <laughs> Don't make me tell, partner. <laughs> it's mine. It's mine. All mine. <laughs> sure. And where's this Moses now? Ew. He's at Benedict Point. The law got him for exhuming. Some people, they feel differently. Not Moses. Him and me are the same. The self same. Well, come on, Seth. Yeah. Let's go see Moses. Get you your map. <laughs> this guy is just yeehaw golem. Maybe you'll help me. Absolutely. All right, partner. Let's go. Dislike. Dislike. Swipe come left. Come on, man, partner. Swipe left. You guys like, you guys love this man? Oh, yes. Uh, channel there, suggestions there. would be great for the, uh, <laughs> for, uh, that. What happened? Now his horse is just all of a sudden not malnourished, or he still is a little looking. His reactions are great. Thank you. <laughs> Freaking Dakuna got the heck out of here. My horse got the absolute heck out of here. Whee! Look at that pretty boy. Look at that pretty boy. Let's go. How can you sink that low? Digging up graves and looting from the dead. As if we've ah, never done that before. The whole damn lot of you. Are you saying it's better to steal from the living? They're corpses. They don't care none. These people have been laid to rest. You don't know nothing. I talked to them long after they've been forgotten by every other fella. I you tell them it's now? all right to be scared and alone. I embrace what? them when they're stinking and rough. I met some sick bastards in my time, Seth. But you, you're special. Focus cold you and heartless what? all their lives. To me, they get warmer when they're actually cold and heartless. Surely that makes sense to even you. Not exactly, it don't. Are we really living anyway? Do you exist outside my mind? Maybe we're both having the same dream, and when we wake up, we'll die. I certainly seem to be in some kind of nightmare. An undead nightmare, perhaps? Yeah! Uh, an undead nightmare? Have you looked Cloud at the Haze? Hey, Sierra! Oh, it's very dark! What'd you say? I didn't say nothing. Bad things to the follow. Welcome in! Something. You're a crazy man. You should get that head looked at. Seth? I need someone who can get a wagon inside Fort Mercer. I was told you could help me, but I'm not sure you even know what day it is. I don't. I can't <laughs> I tell you don't. what year it is. He's like, I nope. knew this was a waste of time. Absolutely so, cannot, you yep. want to go after Bill Williamson, do you? You know Bill? Oh, yes. 
I'm Matt Williamson and Deke, and all them boys. Sometimes they call me on when they get some special job needs doing. I got a reputation as a man who do things most other fellers won't. Now, that I can believe. I reckon you can get in there, no bother. Assuming you help me find this map, that is. Yikes. Uh, yeah, other people have moments. A lot of people have moments and we just never got them, Sierra. It's probably because I asked for them. They said, you know who gets them absolutely What's so last? What's important about this map? Oh, Nothing much. Late, girl. Just unimaginable riches and such like. A spark of hope that lit a rage and fire. My I man, can you please out. drive straight? I thought as much. Can Another you please not be taking up the entire road? The search for nothing. Oh, I lost it all, partner. My wife, my children, my business. Good riddance to them all. Good riddance to them sleep. all? I don't wash and I don't care. Absolutely I vile. I Disgusting. I can smell you from here. It used to be about the money, but now I don't know who I am no more. I Legitimate myself, yeehaw like golem. Looking at somebody else. Only Legitimately. Me. You know? Yeehaw Maybe golem. it's time you moved on. Ooh, there. Okay. Oh, gosh. All right. This is it. Let's stop here a moment and come up with a plan. As far as I know, Moses is being held in that shack. There's a couple of deputies keeping guard outside. Hmm. Can you distract him so I can sneak in for a quick parlay with that son of a bitch? I'm sure I can think of something. <laughs> He's just gonna just... Hop on up there. Oh my god. Where do they go? Mm -hmm. <laughs> literally right as literally right as out of sight. Silver Median out says sequel superior, but the original's fantastic. The game just glitches to hell. <laughs> Steal a deputy's horse to become wanted. I'm already so I'm already so wanted. Hello, sirs. Don't mind me. Just uh. See you later. Oh my God. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Oh God, the freaking horse. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Hey, come back over here. Come back, come back. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Forget the. the all right, all right, all right. These horses, I forget the stamina thing. Goodness. Watch out! I don't know who that guy is. Maybe he will crash into that deputy and everything will be okay. Off-roading. Take a little turn. Come on! Jeez! They're never gonna find me. They'll never find me. They'll never find me. They'll never find me. They'll never find me. All I had to do was like steal a horse, distract them, and then uh, lose my wanted level. Maybe. 760. Son of a gun. I am broke as a joke. My net worth is in the toilet. Uh, bounty remains on my head. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, Seth. Did you get what we needed? Lips. Hello. Good to see you. Uh, I really like yee, the game so far. Greek. I'm really liking the game so far. I think it's a lot of fun. It's got some uh, some charm to it. I do declare. Come on, come on. Hmm. I bet John can just slide down here. <laughs> yep, that was right. 
I was ready to get to slide on down. Did you find? Did you figure out what you needed? Did you figure out what you needed? Good job getting rid of them clowns. Now keep an eye out in case they come back. Moses? Oh, Moses? You got a visitor. Oh, my God, Seth. They arrested me. It weren't my fault. Ah! Get the hell away from me! This guy's just Get running, like, with his hands up. I need him alive, though. Ay, ay, ay. All right, all right. None of your business. Well... Got him. And hog tie, hog tie, hog tie. Why are you doing this? Because somebody asked me to. I really didn't question it. I really didn't Who question it. Who do you think it. you are, Mister? All righty. And who do you Seth think you are? Seth and his own mother. Running around leaving scars. Collecting your jar of hearts. You son of a bitch, let me go. Tearing my part. You're gonna catch a cold from the ice inside. You just wait till I get loose, mister. So don't come back to me. It's Who do you think now. you are? You All right, drop Moses on the mine. ground. Whoop. Moses, you son of a bitch. Torture Where's time! Damn map! Damn you, sir! Damn you, sir! You've always been a twisting little freak! I ain't telling you shit! Torture! Ah, then I'm gonna cut you ah, up ah, piece by piece! <laughs> Till you find your tongue. You do like Man, some casual, crazy uh, in the sun. Uh, casual you take my torture. And start talking. Shut up, Marston! I want to cut into a bona fide man's ah, flesh! Ah, ain't never cut into a live ah, one before! <laughs> Dude, he's going right to like scalp him. Rest. Jesus. Get away from me once and for all. Well, ain't that a damn shame? I was starting to enjoy myself. I think you gone pissed yourself, Moses. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> this is y'all's man. A bounty on your head. Best we clear it now. Don't need the law on our backs. <laughs> This is no y'all's man. I got me a pardon letter. Here, take it. You earned it for helping me with the Moses. Oh, blessed oh, be. Ah, ah. Blessed Best be. We, we got a pardon now, letter. Oh, thank God. Thank God. I think you done pissed yourself. Is this literally the telegraph office right here? So we broke this guy out of jail, threatened to scalp him, stole a, de a deputy horse, and we're just gonna walk right next door to pay off our bounty at the telegram office. Whatever. I ain't gonna Go question speak it. Speak to that fella. Let's get this over with. Yeah, pardon letter. This should clear my name. You better come on. Straight. Just now. give him that part, Larry. We can get out of here. I'll be seeing you again. I hear they found some treasure. We're back to zero, baby. Bread. We're back to zero. Hell yeah. So, mister, thanks for your help. Don't worry yourself with thanks, Seth. Just help me when I come asking. No problem, mister. See you later, Seth. See you later. Plus 25. Oh, baby. There's a question mark right here, too. What are you waiting for? Woohoo! I'm just getting up to speed, mister. Hola. Hello there. All right. Well, like, who's this uh, question mark? I'm just, I'm just curious. Who are you? Talk sir. to the man. My, my. Take a look at you. Will you take a look at you? You look like you've seen trouble, Mister. Enough for a hundred men. That's about right. Trouble has a way of finding me, Mister. 
Do I like the sound of that? Do I ever like the sound of that? Trouble with a capital T. That's just capital. Whatever you say. <laughs> Cold, Whatever. Tough, but with a heart of gold. The cowboy sings his lonely song like, like a dog whose bone is made of wood. Excuse me? Oh, nothing. I, I was just writing my next piece. I've been sent out here to provide a little frontier joie de vivre for the ladies back east. Joie de vivre. I don't understand. I've never heard that say, word in Mr. my life. Yeah, my mom felt the same way. And now she wrote me out of her will, and there's no hope for any of us. <laughs> uh, Jimmy Saint, sir, at your disposal. But uh, please don't dispose of me just yet. <laughs> what are you doing out here, Jimmy? Capturing the spirit of the West for a monthly back East. You know, I'm uh, sending them my oh-so-witty and oh-so-pertinent missives and gaining myself a little prize in the bargain. So it's action I'm after, and action I'm going to find, too. <laughs> Wild men, cheap women, you know, guns, that sort of thing. <laughs> well, you have fun. Fun. Yeah, we'll see you later. <laughs> I have the time of my life, sport. Sport. I tell you, mister, the time of my little old life. <laughs> You're right, have a good one. See you later. Funny man journal entry added. He's just called the funny man? Guns, cheap women. The, the finer things of life. <laughs> we actually need to go to the map. So we found this guy. I'm sure we'll see him again later. I'm sure we will see him again later. Um, there is another stranger over here. Nigel West Dickens. Oh, is this more fat? Wait, no, no, no. <laughs> That's not five finger filet. Is that uh, another? Oh, let no man put asunder. We can head back to Armadillo. I do like Armadillo. I'm not going to lie to y'all. I do like Armadillo. And, um... We can see if Peter is there. Oh, Peter. Okay, actually, though. Cannot set up a campsite here. Oh, okay. Oops. Uh. Ugh, wish this was on PC. I've heard a lot of people say that. I'm literally played on Xbox 360. I, I wish that they would remaster and port it for sure. Hmm. All right, let's see if I can, here we go, set up my campsite. All right, travel to destination. Whoops, wrong button, I hit save instead. <laughs> Whoops, oh, whoops, 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 don't save over those old Scotty save files, I'm sure. He would be very upset. He has not played this game since 2016. <sighs> Travel. That's where we need to go. <laughs> Armadillo. Hmm. Hey, a snake. They were going to remaster it. Yeah, I know. And they decided not to, not to after the backlash. <sighs> it's such a bummer that that game had to ruin it. That it had to, that it ruined it for any Red Dead hopes. I get it, obviously. GTA is rock stars, big, like, cash cow. I get it. Hello. And if it doesn't work with GTA, they're not going to even think about doing it with Red Dead. But boy, oh boy, do I wish that they would put this game in the uh, in the Red Dead 2 engine. Also, hey, welcome in. 360 emulator. Oh my god, it had issues. I can imagine. Oh, I can imagine. <laughs> uh, marshmallows for that campfire. I wish. I absolutely wish he did. All right, here we go. those ladies up there who are we oh yeah we're peter Hi. oh this is probably what yeah maybe here? this is peter the musician hey just so you know i don't take requests mister i'm looking for a man 
Name's Peter. Fellas meant to get married today. Seen him around? Who? Peter, to what she said. <laughs> you ain't after no Pete Turner, are you? For all I know. Where can I find him? <laughs> Six well, feet under. My memory escapes me when not properly stimulated. Then let's see if we can refresh it. Are we getting Five drunk? Will do. Oh. Or you could run a little errand for me. Yes. What do you need done? It's my wife. Oh. She packed her things this morning and left me. Oh, I can't imagine why. The dumb wench is still at the freight station waiting for the stagecoach. If you could convince her to take me back. Her name's Rose. I guess I'll go have a talk with her. <laughs> He's like, I am not You'll paying you five dollars. With that bitch. Dude, I am not gonna convince your wife to come back to you. Uh huh. Good. That's so rude. Romance the wife? I so wish. Mr. Steal Your Girl, John Marston. Jesus. Mm -hmm. Just pay the $5. <laughs> Lady in red. Hey, freakish yo. Oh my god. Excuse me, ma'am. Excuse me, miss. Er, uh, Rose? If that useless whoremongering bastard sent you, get low. Okay. Miss, please. If only. You know what? Tell that bastard I ain't going back. Okay. Not this time. Not even at gunpoint. Okay. You sign an oath, miss. For better or worse. That's rude. The way I see it, you should give him one last chance. Stop bothering me, you dumb cowpoke, or I'll call the marshal. <laughs> That's fair. Hog tie or threaten Rose? I am not tying this lady up. I don't want to threaten her. Oh my god. And end of the mission. Threaten this lady. Hey. Chivalry is dead, they said. Threaten. I guess. How do I threaten her? Rose. I'm trying to threaten you, but I the, the never told you think you hot tighter. Woo! <laughs> oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to hog tire, aren't I? I just wanna know what his threaten would be. Alright, ma'am. <laughs> Ragdoll. I'm s I'm sorry? Oh God, excuse me, sir. I gotta hog tie that lady. Take her back to her husband. Oh, this is the worst. Rose, come back. Rose. Rose. Rose, please. Please, I just, I need him to tell me about Pete. Oh my God, she's so fast. She's zooming, man. She's zooming. She's got a track scholarship somewhere. She said, I'm done waiting for that. That stage go- She is so fast! She is literally so fast. Oh my god. Oh my god, goodness. You're gonna be sorry! Sorry, sorry! You're gonna be sorry? I'm already sorry, honestly. I'm gonna be for real. I, this doesn't feel good. Even for low honor, John Marston. Listen, our low honor ways are more like getting drunk and causing commotions. Not forcing women to stay into marriages where they are uh, miserable, mistreated, underappreciated. It's like kind of the low honor that we stand for here. Instead, I would like to get drunk and insult people. Maybe shoot the occasional, uh, deputy or person who cheats at poker. That's the kind of low honor we stand for. Excuse me, dog. Pardon me. <laughs> John is not a runner at Trackstar. His stamina, we gotta work on it, man. 
He is huffing and puffing and like, yeah, I get it. He's got somebody on his back. <laughs> but even like the... <laughs> she was doing this in like a full skirt. Heels, petticoat, all of that jazz. Oh, out loud. Somebody die over here? What the heck happened here? There's just a dead body? Somebody killed that lady? Oh my god. Somebody did not trip. The dialogue in this game, y'all. The freaking dialogue in this game. Put Rose down. You can go. Maybe you guys should just, like, talk this out. Truth is, Pete Turner ain't been an armadillo for near on 20 years now. <laughs> Peace! Kind of a queer fella and all. Wasn't here every night. Sure as the moon in the sky. What happened to him? Well, <laughs> what happens to all of us? I reckon you'll find him at Odd Fellas Rest. Yeah. That's where he'd be. I dead? Guess. Probably dead. Six feet under. Oh, God. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Ooh, Snake, thanks for the follow. Assume, thank you for the follow as well. Goodness, I, can I loot that lady's body? Oh, wait, John huffs and puffs loud as fuck in this game is hilarious. Honestly, true though. You're not incorrect. Oh my gosh. On the plus side, so that's a new grave to rob. <laughs> oh no, he gave that man a rose. Take your snaps. Take your poetry snaps. Turn them all the way into the bank. You can have them. You've earned them, law dog. <laughs> Be -de -do -de -do. Who did it? Y'all? Four dollars! Nice! <laughs> Bye now! Bye now! Alright. Let's see. Map. Oh, yep. Head back to, uh... Forgive me, sir. Alright, ma'am. Scary little ghosty ma'am. Got some bad news for you. Uh, Pete's been gone 20 years, and you, you probably just don't remember. We got a little bit of a little dementia. A little Alzheimer's. Pete's not coming back. Pete's dead. Oh, never mind. We're not going back to the lady. We're literally going back. Do you think that this is one of the graves that John's seen? Do you think that this is uh, the one that's like he also he had syphilis and gave it to everybody? All right, let's see. Oh, here we go. Peter's right behind Lisa there. Killed by a blow to the head. Oh, on the 15th of January, 19, 1894. He will never dance with another. Yikes! Alright. Jenny! 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 Slow down! Um, hey there. Ma'am. Hello. Hello there. No, I heard you hey, coughing. Uh-uh. What are you doing out here? Um, I'm thinking. Have I seen you before? Oh, uh, yes, I think so. 
On the train from Blackwater, perhaps. Yeah. Yeah, you were talking with the preacher. Oh! What it was. I don't know if it's so safe out here, miss. Oh, Jenny. You can call me Jenny. Uh, uh, all right. Uh, I'm safe because I, I have faith. So uh, faith can move mountains. That's the whole point. Ma'am, Jenny. You're trying to move a mountain? Oh, <laughs> no, uh, I can't do anything. But with faith, I can achieve great things. I know that. I know it. You want me to take you back into town, ma'am? You seem kind of unwell. Oh, I, I get such clarity out here. I see things purely. The <laughs> world is so beautiful. <laughs> and full of things that'll kill you. <laughs> including illness. Girl has heat Nothing's stroke. Gonna kill me, sir. Well? I might kill you. I might. Then. I might. I might do it. See you later, Jenny. <laughs> Tuberculosis. Help Jenny by bringing her medicine. Oh shit! Devil's cake. Helped her. Quest failed. <laughs> she said nothing's gonna kill me, and that that bullet didn't. So maybe yo, maybe Faith protected her after all. Whoop, got her out of there. Yeah, in any case, uh, you know, it got her up and running. Maybe she's going to go take care of herself now. Realize that uh, it's dangerous out there.